In the right window, under Sensors, you can see your enable measurements. If you want to enable more measurements, for example the generator, you click this symbol. Then the generator measurements will appear as well. In this simulation, I will examine what happens when I change different torques and loads on the turbine. So first, I start the simulation. And I want to see the torque difference on the main shaft. That's plotted here. Also, I may want to see the RPM of the turbine. And enable it here to see its plot. So you can see that the torque on the main shaft is uh, positive because I have zero torque from the generator. If I increase the torque from the generator, you see that the difference now is uh, negative and that the RPM of the turbine is decreasing. Another type of load that you can change is the wind speed. Now I have a wind speed of 12, so if I decrease the wind speed, you see that the torque difference on the main shaft is decreasing. First it was positive, but when I decrease the wind speed, the torque on the main shaft is decreasing as well. To get your uh, turbine to stabilize at the speed, you have to have zero torque difference on the main shaft. Now you can see that my uh, turbine has stabilized at approximately 1400 RPMs and TSR of about 6. Apart from plotting the torque difference and RPM, you can also plot the power coefficient. So if I remove the other measurements, I can also plot the power coefficient.